Welcome to California Live, everyone. Today is a very special day here in Los Angeles. The city is most definitely in tears, celebrating the incredible life of Kobe Bryant, his beautiful daughter Gigi, and the seven others who died when their helicopter crashed on that foggy Sunday morning in January. More than 20,000 people have filled Staples Center today to pay tribute, but there is one man in Costa Mesa who has put together a tribute of his own. And Danny, I understand his tribute has touched the hearts of thousands over the last few weeks. Yeah, Jess, I think we all have a story about how Kobe and his family have inspired us and showed so much courage throughout this whole thing. And can you imagine being so inspired, you drop everything and create a work of art? Well, I'm here today with the artist. This is Tyke, everyone. Hello. Hi, Hello, how are you? I am doing good. Um, this is just beautiful. Thank it's, you. It's, it's, it's breathtaking. Thank you. What inspired you to just stop and say, um, I've got to create this? You know what? When I heard the tragic news, I was pretty depressed and still am in shock. And so for two days, I couldn't do much work. So I just started sketching. And initially, I had this wall. I wanted to do a Laker mural uh, about the team today, about the past team, just because I feel like they're going to win this year. And I know it. So I was going to do this. So when I heard the news, I decided to change it, dedicate it just to Kobe, Gianna, and all the victims in this tragic accident. So I stayed up doing sketches. And uh, between work and taking my, my two daughters to school and being a dad, a parent, I had time to do this. And we st started around midnight on a Wednesday night. Yeah. Well, Tyke, tell me that part about it. You're a father. Yes. You, have, you have daughters. This yes. is personal for you. Yeah. I mean, it's, I love my daughters more than anything in the world. So I know Kobe felt the same way. And he sacrificed a lot for L.A., for his fans, for, to, to work hard and have that, you know, Mamba mentality, that drive he had, that's time away from your family. And a lot of times I don't do my art because I'd rather stay home with my family. And that man chose to do his art. So it puts things in perspective that sometimes, you, you know, you got to just do your art and not sleep, not do stuff and be with your family, but you got to sacrifice things like your own personal time. So yeah. that's and, what drove me. And you didn't sleep for two days. Yeah, I didn't sleep for two days. Yeah. to finish this mural because I had to go to work the next day and do stuff. So I was almost on autopilot just painting it. And tell me a little bit about the mural. We see that the na everyone's names are on this, yes. Kobe and Gianna. Um, I had, since, you know, Orange County, all the victims are from this town, from Orange County. I had uh, my friend do some sign painting of all their names. And I uh, have a lot of symbolism in here. I have nine souls lifting into the heavens. I have uh, Kobe's eight is made up of two halos that are intertwined for him and his daughter. So th that's my inspiration. Now, obviously, the, the Lakers logo and putting Gigi's name in the K was part of uh, the plan from the beginning. Yeah, and this really brought out the community here. People yes. came out in the middle of the night at midnight sure to, to see it all. Yeah. Um, can we bring Matt? Come on out here. We have to bring in Matt. Matt is the man who captured it all. Yeah, um, thank you. <clears throat> what did you what compelled you to grab the camera? What did you see? Well, uh, Bert called me, and he's like, hey, we're going to do this mural. I'd, I'd love for you to be a part of it. And I was like, sure, it sounds great. When? He's like, tonight at midnight. And so it was one of those things where, you know, I'm a father too, so I, I was definitely impacted by what happened. And you start reflecting on, on life and, and the choices you make. And it was one of those things where I was driving home after a long day, but it didn't even dawn on me. Of course I want to be a part of it. It was an honor. And I came out here, and, and, and we started documenting it, and it was amazing to see the community come out. It was amazing to see all these people just drawn to what was happening. And that was before any, any, any media, so that was just social media. It was totally organic, and, and it was just it was amazing to be a part of that. Yeah, and the, I love this part of the story, guys. He called you at midnight. Tyke was like, um, we're going out there. Oh, yeah, it was yeah, like a two-hour notice. And the same with him buying the paint and everything. I mean, it was go time, right? It was the only time we all had. And it was a good 36-hour, 48-hour run, but it was worth it. It was amazing to, to get an opportunity to capture it, and, and hopefully people can, can see what went into it. Yeah, and do you realize the impact that you've made on this community? Um, you know what? I, initially, I just did it for, for myself and for the Bryant family and all the rest of the, the families so they can have a place, not all the way in L.A., but close to home where they can honor, reflect, leave flowers. So... I, seeing the impact is overwhelming. It's been very uh, humbling to see it spread and shared. And the kind words I get on Instagram means a lot to me. And people have left flowers and messages. It's amazing. And, yeah. It's so beautiful. And this was happening night night one. People were bringing, bringing things out and telling their stories and sharing their stories of how Kobe touched their lives. 
So it was amazing, just incredible situation. And people still out here, people have gathered here since the time right, that we right started. Now. <laughs> uh, right now. And so this will stay here? Yes. It's not going anywhere? No. Not going anywhere. No. Not going anywhere. No. And I have paint, I can do touch ups. People sometimes get silly and ride on things, and I've touched it up already once. Yeah. But uh, yeah, it's staying here, it's permanent. Yeah. Well, thank, thank you guys so much. This is such an inspiration. It's beautiful work, thank and I mean, it's brought people to tears. So thank you so much. Thank Wonderful. you guys. Thank you. Thank, thank, you. You. thank you. And stick with us. We'll be